This is one that has been used later on to critique of, of authoritarianism. Um, it's more implicit than explicit. Uh, if you follow the Luwang, Luwang school, and always on the cosmology, there's a heavy emphasis on the individual. My mind is the essence of nature. So there's a tremendous uh, individual, individual um, <coughs> quest. And using the individual quest as a way of making moral judgment and then moral metaphysics. So you never, it's a very individual, individualistic philosophy. And then anything that go, you then establish a person, uh, a inner sage, that I can make my own decision. I don't need to follow <coughs> if I think that it's not um, applicable to me. So there's a very, you can say, very um, um, self-centered uh, philosophy. And that could be dangerous, but it also can be used as, as, a, as a foundation to critique any forms of authoritarian rule. And uh, um, in, in other words, I'm, I'm equipped morally. So in a way, not, no one can um, give, me a, uh, get, uh, give me any order. I order myself. So that is the, the, the ground of, um, uh, of his critique of authoritarianism. He didn't say that clearly. But you, have, you go with this, follow these arguments. Then the conclusion would be, each person is individually operating on, on his or her own. 